Good morning, boys and girls. So today we are starting our review of division. Since y'all have done pretty well with division, I found this tool called My Math Pal Division Helper that is going to help you walk step by step through a division problem to make sure you understand how to divide. So you'll see this is a link in your um, folder for today. You will click on the blue words to open it up in a new tab. And once it loads, I will walk you through how to do it. So you're going to see divide pal pop up. You have divisor digits, and I want you to click on, um, you can start with one, but if you get one really easily, go ahead and move to two. I'm going to demonstrate with one. Dividend digits, keep it on three. And then I want you to check that use remainder box and click start. It's literally going to walk you through step by step how to solve division to help you remember. Can the divisor two go into the first digit of the dividend seven? Yes, that's correct. Okay, so then it's going to take you to the next step. How many times can two go into seven? Well, I know that two can go into seven three times. So I'm going to check my answer. And so I enter three into the box. What is two times three? It's six. Check my answer. That's right. So it's going to ask me to answer six into the box. What is seven minus six? Seven minus six is one. And the reason that I chose to do this is because I had some people, um, especially face-to-face -face friends and some virtual friends come to me and say, Miss Solly, we remember how to divide. We just can't remember what order to do the steps in. And so this division pal is going to walk you through each step of the division problem. And so you saw that it just brought our nine down. Now you're asking how many times can two go into 19? Well, two can go into 19 nine times. And it's gonna tell you whether you got it correct or not and show you exactly where to put your answers on the division problem, which is really gonna help you remember these steps when you need them, okay? So you can see it's walking me through exactly how to do the division problem. Say I get a number incorrect, it's not gonna let me move on here because I already answered it. It's gonna bring down the seven, but here's what I can do. So I know that two goes into 17 eight times, but just say I click seven. It's gonna tell me, uh-oh, it goes into it more times than that. So if I click nine, it's gonna say, oh, nine's too high. It goes into it less times than that. I know two goes into 17 eight times and I put eight in my box. Two times eight is 16. And since we put with the remainder, it's gonna let us have a remainder. So we enter one in our box and this one is our remainder, right? The remainder's one. So after you've walked through one problem, you can try an another, but once you have understood it, I want you to go to change settings and move to two divisor digits and I want you to walk through that and then the last one I want you to do is four dividends with two divisors okay so you should work through three problems on your own and make sure you do your five minutes of extra math and then tomorrow I'm going to post an old video to review decimal um, division and you'll have a short assignment with that um, Thursday will be a Kahoot review and Friday will be a division assessment. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me. I hope that you have an amazing rest of your day.